It's now been one full month since nearly 9,000 structures were burned in one of the most destructive weeks of wildfires in California history. Over the last couple of weeks, even as the debris removal process was ramping up, many residents wondered what the operation would look like and how their lot would look once it was clean. This is what this disaster management should be. It should be on it, fix it, and let's move on and, 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 and enjoy life. We were able to see the first lot in Santa Rosa being cleared. This lot is now clean, debris free, and ready for the rebuilding to begin. This starts to feel like, okay, there's some hope. There's. Well, with the, uh, when they said the Army Corps was gonna come in and have this cleared out hopefully early 2018, right. I go, I'll believe it when I see it. Well, <laughs> I'm seeing it. There you go. <laughs> so it's... In order for your lot to be cleaned by the Consolidated State and Federal Program at no cost to you, you must sign a right of entry form from your county. Over 2,000 residents have submitted their right of entry forms in Sonoma County alone, hundreds more in Mendocino, Napa, and Yuba counties. But officials warn there is still a long way to go to reach their goal by the November 13th deadline. 13th deadline is absolutely critical. I cannot underscore enough that the deadline to get the rights of entry forms in on the 13th of November is an absolute critical time. And look, we need those rights of entry to, to, to get these lots cleared. You know, we've only got a few thousand of them. We have over 6,000 parcels. This is just one example of what a clean lot will look like when finished. What's removed off of your lot may be different based on the site-by-site -site evaluation by debris removal experts. This is no small disaster. This is no small challenge. Homeowners who lost their property, even those within the firefighting community, are signing the right of entry forms and hoping their neighbors do the same. Hopefully we'll see a lot of ROEs in our, in our areas that will allow the Army Corps of Engineers to quickly and efficiently do a lot of good work. Um, and it'll also give me time to focus on other things um, and work towards my rebuilding, working with an architect, working with a, with a designer, a builder, and then continue moving forward with my own recovery process. If you still have questions about signing a right of entry form, we suggest you talk to your insurance agent or drop by your local county office or right of entry center. These ROE centers will be open through the weekend and they are there for you to turn in your signed forms or to answer any questions. For locations of the centers and answers to frequently asked questions, visit our website at wildfirerecovery.org. And if you'd like to see additional video on the first lots cleared, go to our Cal OES Facebook page or YouTube channel. For all of us at Cal OES, I'm Brian May.